one advantage of expressing ratios as percentages is that it makes it easier to use a chart to present them. Here's an example. Meet Taylor. She's also one of the kids in the band. We can see her here gazing out the window during her math class. Of course, she is supposed to be focused on math, but ever since Alexis and Jamal invited her to be in their band, she has been distracted. Her attention has been riveted on the band contest, especially after she saw the media vehicles begin rolling onto the campus for the big competition that evening. Distracted, but trying to do some math, she counted how many types of vehicles passed by during the class period. She recorded her count by keeping a tally on a sheet of paper. How many of these people are coming in for the big event tonight, she asked herself. She counted 24 cars, 12 pickup trucks, 4 media crew vans, 6 school buses, and 2 motorcycles, a total of 48 vehicles. Taylor, we're discussing circle graphs. Are you still with us? Her teacher asked. Yes, I'm listening. I'll admit, I'm pretty excited about tonight, but I've channeled my excitement into a way that will contribute to our topic. You asked us to create a circle graph, so here's the data I've gathered. I've also calculated the ratio to illustrate the percentage of the circle graph that represents each type of vehicle I believe is streaming in for tonight's Battle of the Bands. Taylor's first ratio of cars to total vehicles would be 24 to 48. This ratio simplifies to one car for every two vehicles that Taylor saw. This would be the same as 50%, or half, of the circle chart. Taylor counted 12 trucks. Following the same procedure she used for cars, Taylor determined that the ratio for trucks to total vehicles is 12 to 48, or one truck for every four vehicles. This is equivalent to 25% of the circle. Following the same steps, we can determine the percentage of the circle for each type of vehicle that Taylor saw. Taylor's pie chart would look like this. As you can see, a pie chart or circle graph is a great tool to help you visualize ratios in percent form. This chart allows us to see the ratio of different types of vehicles to the total number of vehicles Taylor counted. Let's practice with Alexis and Jamal as they double-check the participation rules for tonight's competition. 